is going on you guys welcome back to the channel this is drew here today we're gonna to be reacting to genshin impact 4.6 full live stream now if you guys uh are if you guys do enjoy please do make sure to like and subscribe we're so close to 1000 subscribers but i do want to mention one thing that this video is kind of low quality but it's still my full reaction um and by low quality i literally mean the quality i don't know what happened it is very low but it's still my full reaction so if you guys want to skip this one all good um but i don't want to re-record it be not just because i don't want to re-record it but i don't want to fake my reaction i think i actually thought my reaction was pretty good it's just something happened <laughs> so yeah hope you guys enjoy and let's get into it genshin impact 4.6 baby it has been millennia since the fall of remuria and its history millennia. has long faded into the mists of mythology and superstition oh snap legends tell of how before the birth of the court of fontaine there was an empire known as Remuria. Kay. Remurians believed their king Remus would bring eternal prosperity to the islands of the high sea. However, the god king's seers prophesied discord. Hey, yo, discord. The greatest empire will face the most utter destruction, and this is Fortuna. Fortuna. Thus did the what god is this, like king the underwater derive the primordial area? plan. From the cycle of the seven days the and maker. winds blowing over sea and land, and composed a splendorous symphony based upon it. So is 4.6 going to be like a big water heavy air, like a story? He believed that the polities could escape fate's judgment and attain eternal paradise if they harmonized with his perfect symphony. But looks cool. Looks, looks kind of chill. Welcome to the Genshin Impact version 4.6 special hey, program! W Let's transition. take a look at the trailer! Oh, that wasn't the trailer? On occasion, we hold barbecue dinners at the house. Mm. They hunt for food, compete like with each other, barbecue. even cooperate. They enjoy participating in activities like that. Oh my gosh! Mutual. Genshin the horror game? After all, it's always possible certain familiar faces will be missing from the crowd the next time a similar event rolls around. Something has come up, and since it pertains to Cyrus and Sino, I deemed it hey. essential to inform you all. It was a great plan. What the heck? Shrouded in secrecy. We all gathered around and celebrated the revival of our lord. That's how I gained my power. The old man's oh, been putting snap. the pressure on me. He sent someone to tell me I'm needed for some sort of project. Project Stuja? Participating Stuja. in the plan will lose a lot of members in the process. But I did not oh my god, this looks so cool. After presenting you with the Gnosis. If you accept my proposal, Monsieur Nevelet, unless absolutely necessary, Why are they treating this like it's an endgame, no bro? I will carry out any special mission hey. within the Fontaine. Arlecchino! That's right! I totally forgot he got revealed. I'm an idiot. Oh, we get into that gameplay. Oh. Wait. Transfixed. Oh, this is high. At the moon. Now I see why you wanted me to pull for this An one specifically. Once given cannot now be I see. Rescinded. Do you have any idea what you're doing? You're hiding the very person Father has been trying to find. I really didn't mean to drag anyone else into this. If Father finds out about this, everyone involved is going to be punished. Oh shit. Traitor. Sino was chosen, but he was not the only one. <laughs> oh like my god. To turn my power. I'm really looking forward to this rite of duels. The wisdom of Hermanubis would have been ours. I want you to become the next okay. king of the house. Oh, this tops 4.5 by so much. I'm not saying I have all the answers, but doing so will only bring us further away from being a real family. Your words paint Daniel. an optimistic picture indeed. Allow me to remind you, however, you among us are willing to sip from a glass filled with tasty water. We all make sure this is insane. This is insane. to its cleanest form. Good things come to children who do as they're told. So I do yeah, hope you I have to try and get all the Gino, bro. I have to try. There are many dangers ahead, and I, for one, don't Jeez. intend to back down. I don't want to disobey the uh, father. So uh, why? Why have you backed us into a corner? No demonstration of loyalty shall go unrewarded. And no. Is this the best character in Genshin Impact or what? Sacrifice shall be in vain. 
That is so awesome. Two worlds of flame, the Crimson Knight fades. Dun, 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 dun. Hello, everyone. I'm Sarah Miller Cruz, the boy. My bros, my guys, my dudes. Dude. So dude. <laughs> Are you excited to be here? Vibes, vibes, vibes. <laughs> vibes for days. <laughs> All right. Well, without any further delay, let's start introducing the new content from version 4.6. I've heard that travelers will be experiencing new content related to the House of the Hearth in the upcoming version. Aaron, why don't you give us a rundown on what sort of organization the House of the Hearth is? I need to catch is. up on Genshin yes, so it bad, my bro. Pleasure. Based on the most recent intelligence reports, the House of the Hearth is a Fatui intelligence organization operated by the Knave. Uh, it takes in children who no longer have a home due to all manner of reasons, and Damn. they receive an education in a variety of disciplines. Naturally, at the same time as it provides a home, the children also take on various responsibilities. Okay, this sounds like Does everything Genshin only that we have already English know from and the game. Japanese voice uh, actor? Is there more news to hear? Yes, everyone knows that the House of the Hearth is a rather complicated orphanage, and the Knave, the fourth harbinger of the Fatui, is still hiding many unsolved mysteries. So how about we start diving into all the new information that we have about our Lakino? Let's do it! Yes, let's Arlequino? do it! Okay, Everybody's okay. going to be mad I've been saying I, I want to hear it straight from y'all. What kind of person do you think the Knave is? Said our Latino. Oh my gosh, Hello. I'm feeling a lot of pressure right now. <laughs> this is giving me all sorts of deja vu. <laughs> um, I guess during the Fontaine Archon quest, I noticed that Arlequina was really skilled at directing the conversation. Her way of speaking was incredibly refined and polite, but she was also incredibly intimidating. <laughs> I mean, remember how Farina pretended not to recognize her and talked about having nightmares? I totally get where she was coming from. Mm. But that's just an outsider's point of view, right? Oh, I thought what they were going like, to go in and like show some stuff. Parent? I think Damon is probably the best oh. person to answer that question. <laughs> okay, take it away. Oh, okay, you were hoping that I would be the weakest link? Damn. Yeah. Well, <laughs> she's a very strict father. This is scripted, right? Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. Strict. Um, hmm. All right, it sounds like she gives everyone an intimidating impression. Yeah, but I think Arlequino loves all of the house's children equally, and she would never treat them harshly for no reason, though... The kids feel a lot of pressure yeah. during her lessons and are often scared speechless cool. by her stern attitude. Uh, I would expect it to for be, their own but good. It, in it's an still cool that they got like two like, these kids actually need to be more in here. sure, tough, and patient than other children who are their age. You know. Mm, that's actually kind of sad, though, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Yeah. Are the Kino sad backstory? Hurt this knave. I want to know why are they this <laughs> way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, wait. Are you trying to say that she treats the kids like that because she was traumatized? Ooh, <laughs> yeah, sounds okay. like it. Now that's very sharp of you, oh, no. but <laughs> let's keep Arlequino's secrets hidden for just a little bit longer. Is okay, Arlequino okay. going to have a whole storyline? Um, I do have a question, though. Why do the children call her father? Or do, do they, ah, well, is she already? If you're curious about Arlequino's past, then oh. you'll have to find your answer in yep. the game. Okay, they answer my questions. Yeah. They answer my questions right now. 4. 6. That's now, cool. I don't want to spoil anyone's gameplay experience by saying too much about her quest, okay? But I do hope that travelers will be able to appreciate Arlequino's unique charm after they've experienced her entire story. <laughs> yeah. Version 4.6 will also introduce a new feature, the focused experience mode. Ooh. Now, if you use the feature while playing Arlequino's story quest, then it will minimize the number of times that you'll be interrupted by characters or quest locations being allocated to other quests. Mm. So hopefully this mode will okay. help travelers have a better story experience, cool. you know? Nice. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. And in the future, this function will become available for more and more quests. Sadly, I'm still at the very beginning of the game, so it's going to take me a while to get there. Honestly, one thing that threw me off about Genshin is having to level up to level 16 to start the story. Besides but the story quest, I'm, working on I'm it. also looking forward to hearing the Knave's voiceover lines because Aaron's kind of awesome. <laughs> <laughs> we'll finally be able to hear what she thinks about the other Harbingers, too. Yes, I selfishly also think that will be cool. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Next, let's take a look at Arlequino's elegant yet deadly fighting style. Yeah. <laughs> Intrigue. That is, yeah. They have the coolest fighting style to me. Staring into my eyes is ill-advised. I can't promise you'll like what you see. I like what I see. Transfixed. So cool, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna save every damn point I get, bro. 
every damn point I get. This is where you fall. Damn, this is so soon. I might have to drop some money, bro. Oh, she's so cool, that was awesome. yeah, she's cool. She is cool. I like how she glides. Yes. Yes. Yeah, she's very elegant. Like that was a perfect descriptor. Like elegant but deadly. Like a yes, like a ballerina of death. Yes. Ballerina yeah. of death is crazy. So effortless. I know, right? Yes. All right. Well, if we're going to talk about Arlequino's combat abilities, then we're gonna have to talk about the bond of life mechanic. Uh, you Hello? might have been a victim to it while you were fighting elite Fatui operatives in Damn. Hunting. Victims. Does anyone still remember what a bond Yo, is? Yo, that's cool, just sitting in the chair like this. Yo, wait, are you that's gonna be anime us villain about shit, bro. Guys, you're too loud. Pipe oh. down. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. My bad. Wait, let's listen to what she has to say. <laughs> wait, I, I think I remember. It's the red portion of the HP bar. When you have a bond of life active, it'll absorb any healing that your character receives. So. They can't regain HP until the bond of life value has been healed. Yeah. Yes. Right? Very good, <laughs> student. <laughs> when Arlequino <laughs> has a bond of life greater than or equal to a certain percentage of her health bar, her normal charged and plunging attacks will be converted to pyro damage, which can't okay. be overridden by other elemental infusions. And while she's oh. in this state, her normal attacks will consume a portion of her current bond of life to deal more damage and reduce the remaining cooldown on her elemental skill. Makes sense. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait a second. It's a lot, it's a lot. So you're saying that she'll deal more damage with her normal attack when her bond of life is higher? <laughs> Put simply, yes. Whoa, 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 wait a second. <laughs> no, wait, I get it. Wait, so uh, Arlequino can give herself a bond of life, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I think so. I mean, otherwise she'd have to chase down enemies who can put a bond of life on her. So she can have Actually, her own that, bond of life? That sounds kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to see that. Uh, and that brings us to our elemental skill. Yeah. Our Latina skill doesn't just damage enemies. Holy it shit, God, also dude. applies oh. a blood debt directly That is so to cool, any enemy side. that hits, which will damage them periodically. Bro. And when she uses a charged attack or her elemental burst, she'll absorb nearby blood debt directives. This also allows her to obtain a bond of life based on the number of directives that she absorbed. So don't worry, Max. Oh, I was very concerned. <laughs> I know, I know you were. <laughs> okay, hold on. She can't regain HP until her bond of life is removed, right? So how does she stay in the fight? I'm just in awe well, of the gameplay right now. After dishing out damage, I'm really, elemental I like this character. will reset the cooldown of her I think everybody skill does. and heal her. That was like one of Genshin Impact's and most liked uh, oh, tweets. Okay. Also, Thanks to one of her talents, while Arlequino is in combat, she gains bonus pyro damage, but also cannot be affected by any healing effects other than the healing provided by her burst. Oh, so I, that seems like she's as ruthless to herself yeah, as yeah, she yeah. is to her mm. enemies. Like she needs therapy, probably. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, they are making she's me think this backstory is gonna savage. be dark. I mean, <laughs> um, right. So Arlequino even has a special kind of movement whenever she uses her charged attack, mm. right? Ooh, that looks perfect for scaring your enemies. Yes. Yeah. She just flies over the water. Some serious pressure on them. Yeah. Bruh. <laughs> oh my god, the scythe looks huge. Uh -huh. Oh, it's about time to introduce the event wishes in version 4.6. You guys ready? Yeah. Let's do it. So exciting. All right. During the first phase of version 4.6, Arlequino, the knave, and Linny will both enjoy a drop rate boost. The all new five star polearm Crimson Moon semblance will also. I just realized something. As a new Genshin fan, I forgot once you pull a character, you don't pull their weapon. So I have to pull the weapon separately. So become available. Yeah. Also, the Wanderer and Baiju will yeah. return in the second phase. Wanderer. So be sure to keep an eye out. Yay! That's cool, because I kind of like Lenny, and I kind of like Wanderer. I'm not the biggest fan of Baiju. Uh, yeah, but oh my gosh, that's cool. so amazing. So, <laughs> okay, so Aaron and Damon... Do you so have any cool. other news you'd like to so share? Either way, I'll kind of get Actually, a character I want. I do. Time to eat. Let's hey, enjoy your food, brother. The new weekly boss. Oh That's my God. right. We were just talking about how the knave shows different faces to her family members and to outsiders, but in special circumstances, she will reveal another side. Mm. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Are you ready to see a new knave? Yes! Ready? I am ready! So ready! Damn. Enjoy your drink. I am. Um, dream hydrate? Hey. 
Now we suck me in with this music. Pause. Hey. 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 Oh my gosh. Arlequino to Smash Brothers. Make it happen. I'm surprised Genshin never did anything with Smash Bros. I guess it came out like a year after Smash Bros, but they still could have made it happen. Suck what? Yo. Pause, bro. Yo, you can fight? Oh, this, this is cool. They're full on showing us this boss fight right now. What level do you have to be to do this though? Wow. <laughs> it took me like a year to get there. I've seen this side of her before. Mm. So the knave is accepting challengers now? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Looks like Gosh, it. Gosh, she's so elegant, but also super duper dangerous. Yeah, she's so, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that feels even more badass with twice the badassitude. <laughs> <laughs> It's not so simple to hey. see the knave's other side. Hey. She'll appear normally at first, as if she were giving you Depends an ordinary training level? lesson, oh, okay. waiting to counter your attacks. Yeah, it seems like she'll dodge all of our attacks like a phantom if we're out of her immediate range. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it feels like she's implying that we're oh all in the palm of her hand. <laughs> I mean, you guys know what her person is This is actually like. really she cool. She want her children <laughs> crying or running away from conflict. Looks kind of easy, Instead, though. Instead, she hopes that they'll be able to take the initiative. Maybe that's because I played Dark Souls. Their opponent is their own father. The outside world will not show her children mercy, so neither can she afford to be too forgiving to them. Mm. If you do not repay the blood debt directives the knave applies to you, all of her attacks against really you will be enhanced. But if you manage to outheal the bond of life, the knave the will the reward level, the you for repaying the enemies this blood get. debt, and your charged attacks against her will be enhanced. Don't the bone wings on her back look like spiders? <laughs> yes, yes, that's it. <laughs> like it. Oh my gosh. It's like she has total control of her prey while she watches them struggle and closes the distance. <laughs> oh, it's kind of creepy being the hunted one for once. <laughs> <sighs> So, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I think we should stop the introduction here. <laughs> Let's leave some space for everyone to experience the challenge for themselves. Yeah, y'all so did show a lot. They showed a lot of that. will be wondering about this. The Knave's boss form is tied to her story quest. Mm -hmm. Normally, okay. players would have to progress the story to a certain point in order to participate in the challenge. But now we have a quick challenge feature for weekly Trounce domain bosses. Yeah. So I can play this at any level? Are adventure rank 40 or higher, they'll be able to challenge her directly Chad, I'm level nine. By going to the adventurer handbook, going to the I don't think I can get there in a by the time this comes out and pressing quick challenge. Wow, oh, that's cool. That's a yeah. nice little shortcut to the battle. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> that is really valuable information to have. <laughs> and it also looks like it's my turn to deliver some news. Two new artifact sets will become available in version 4.6: Fragment of Harmonic Whimsy and Reverie. Travelers who are interested in them should stay tuned for more information. Cool. Oh, you're finished. Okay, wait, how come your update was so short? It wasn't enough for me. Yeah, give us more. Okay, okay, I actually do have other news to share. Ooh. Uh, more news? Ooh. Yes, 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 yes. In version 4.6, Sumeru City will be experiencing an unsolved mystery. Mm. And for some reason, Sino's gotten mixed up in it. Hey, how did you know hey. about that? It, it was in the trailer. Oh, he was in the trailer too. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> well, Sino like, wanted to investigate that, personally. That looks really cool. Someone involved in the case has a very unique identity. This is a and W the two of them share a close connection. Uh, sounds like there's some serious shenanigans going That's on. That's right. Is this a case where we get Nito to use the be the best voice if actor. the situation gets too complicated? Yes. These are Max? all very good guesses, but I'll offer you one clue that you probably wouldn't be able to guess otherwise. Uh? A mysterious youngster with connections to the mystery will make his debut during the case. Hmm. And okay. Sino's friends are not just freeloaders. <laughs> a mysterious youngster just shows a picture of him. <laughs> Tainari, Kale, Alhatham, and Kave will all come to support him when he's in a pinch. So, yeah, if you want to know more about what happens in this case, then be sure to check out Sino's second story quest. Lupus Arius Act 2. 
Travelers can venture to Sumeru and investigate the secret. That was the one they. This the has sand. to be the one they just teased in the trailer, in right? Where they were time, doing, where he's doing that guy. <laughs> Sarah, you totally doing delivered. Him. That was great news. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Speaking of great news, Ooh. I think Damon also has wait. some important information wait, to share. Wait, 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 wait. Really? Wait, yes. wait, wait. What are we wait. waiting for? We've oh. just presented too much information too quickly. C can we can we take a break, please, so we can digest? Oh, Sarah's one of the worst characters I pulled for. Really? He can't keep getting away I with this. Do, though. <laughs> right. No, no, Damon, you're right. I know. Let's check out the first redemption code before we continue introducing the new content. That's what I thought. <laughs> That was amazing. That's what I thought. <laughs> Are these the codes for the game? Okay. People watching my video, if y'all want to screenshot that real quick or whatever, but we're going to skip that. Hey. We've already New told area. you the story of Arlequino. Yeah, they also House showed this Arts. in the trailer earlier. So, right? why don't we continue the story of Remuria, which you saw in the beginning of the program? I would like yeah. this very much, please. <laughs> yes, you did such <laughs> yes, a good job. Yes. Encore, <sighs> encore. <laughs> a new area of Fontaine will open in version 4.6. Travelers will get to visit the village of Petricor. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Though, would there even be much to see on such a small island? Well, yeah, I guess this is this is where I'm supposed to really confidently say totally, right? It is, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that you've mentioned it, there's definitely more to this village than meets the eye, right? Yeah, I think we're focused on the wrong thing here. This is where the kingdom of Remuria's remains lay at rest. So how big was such a glorious and prosperous so nation, fun. really? Mm. Oh, well, now that you say that, I mean, this little town the looks fuck? a whole lot bigger. This is a cat, John. that's a neat trick. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> this is where we'll meet a talking cat. With its guidance, we will be able to see what? the civilization that vanished thousands of years ago. What? Oh my gosh, uh, that's amazing! Anything for a talking cat. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> As Aaron mentioned at the beginning of the program, King Remus composed a symphony, one with wondrous power that grants the wishes of the human souls dwelling within. Yes, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. I'm, I, I actually, I don't You're get it. You're so not getting <laughs> it, that's okay. I will explain <laughs> it in a few words, so you'll just have to learn about the symphony by going on an adventure with this little cat. <sighs> I just can't wait to get this point in the game, man. But or, we'll arrive yeah, I don't want to rush the journey either. With the cat. But the, the whole remnants, adventure, the, depths where the, sunlight the whole adventure ranking leveling thing that I'm at right now is really boring. Can't so reach. I watch these the trailers to look in the future. Seas. I'm like, hey, this is what That's you got to keep grinding for, bro. <laughs> So, you'll be able to obtain powers relating to the symphony, which will help you explore the lost realm of Remuria. You'll be able to pause the melody within the realm of this ancient civilization. You can also unseal time in places where it stopped. So, oh, these cool. powers will let you interact with specific objects in mm -hmm. the ruins. You know, that might be useful for solving puzzles during your adventure. Totally. Ooh. Meanwhile, a forgotten statue sits in a recess of the fated castle, silently proclaiming the immortality and glory of a great civilization. It awaits a warrior who would dare challenge the majesty of the ancient ruler. Oh yeah, that's right. The statue of marble and brass will soon Nine be Nine hours left before the boss. codes expire, by the way. You can earn all I'm gonna add the map right after my stream. manage to beat it in a challenge. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so hyped for it. <laughs> Me oh too. my gosh, yes. And Damon, you did such a great yes. job. Little challenge? That was great. great. That was Okay, Damon. Wait, but real quick, quick question. Yeah. How do we even get to such a remote little island? That is a great question. Travelers who have already completed the third act of the Archon Quest, Song of the Dragon and Freedom, will automatically unlock a teleport waypoint in the village of Petricor. So not Hopefully me. Hopefully <laughs> this helps travelers with exploring the new area. I've heard that this feature will return for many new areas in the future. Uh, so exciting. I know. So cool. <laughs> all right. Oh, wow. That actually looks like a cool little area. about Fontaine for now. And now, outside of the region, <laughs> dot dot dot. It da, da, da. seems like a new style of rock and roll is getting popular in Inazuma. <gasps> rock and roll. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's all take a short break before we get into the next. Is section. this like the same thing take as the other ones, where they do like a world redemption a rock star code? Yeah. All right. Another redemption code. All right, people in the video, if you want it, screenshot it. But we're gonna skip past this. Welcome back, everyone. Hey. <laughs> okay, I hear that a musical tour is coming Guru? to Inazuma, and the organizer yeah, the is world none tour. other than Arataki this isn't some Ito old, himself. Uh, version trailers as well. <laughs> <laughs> Max, would you like to tell us more about it? 
It would be my absolute pleasure, compadre. So I got a question. Does everyone still remember Dvorak? Mm -hmm. um... Of course. He participated in last year's Lantern Rite, mm -hmm. right? That's oh, right. Yeah. yeah. Both Hu Tao and Shin Yen performed is that there. this dude? That's Ooh. right. And oh my god, is that the legendary Genshin Impact rap they're referring to? Dude, I remember when I first saw the Genshin Impact rap, I was just sitting there acting like, oh yeah, this is cool. Dude, I was cringing so hard when I first seen that, but I was like, I don't want to like make the Genshin, it was my first Genshin Impact video. I was like, I can't make the Genshin ma fans mad by saying this is cringe. So I was like, yeah, yeah, this is cool. But that and was this so time, funny. It's an epic tour for the ages organized by none other than Ito and Dvorak. Oh, oh my gosh. And even the concert name sounds really epic. Yeah. Oh, does. yeah. No, the way he says iridescent arataki rockin' for life tour to force of awesomeness really gives off the feeling of rock and roll. Wow. <laughs> and the theme of this concert is about life. Specifically, it's about a brave puppy who saved the lives of countless other creatures on the battlefield. Oh, that's so cute. Adorable. I'm really yeah. looking forward to it. <laughs> yeah, me too. I really hope the Music Festival of Life will inspire everyone to unleash their own rock and roll spirit. Yeah. And I'll let you in on a little secret. Okay. Ito himself will personally be performing on the big stage. Let's go. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be awesome. <laughs> yes, it will be. And here's more exclusive news for you. Dvorak will be giving away a brand new musical instrument to our try travelers to get the called community the Nightwind okay, Horn. Ooh. So if you enjoy playing music in real life, or especially if you enjoy playing music in the game, be sure to check it out. I'm looking forward to seeing more amazing performances from all the great musicians out there. I've oh, seen yeah. some cool well, stuff with the music playing so in uh, Genshin. Like, people festival. actually playing songs from Undertale. Why don't you help launch the Arataki Rockin' for Life Tour? to force of awesomeness. Yeah, I'll try to. <laughs> yeah, that is okay. There's three steps to preparing for the festival. Number one, extreme carnival ensemble. We can practice getting into the flow with some rhythm games while the stage Ooh. is still coming together. Wow, those keys look really unique. Yeah, they really are. And the second task They're is just called cats. the Trillion Trinket <laughs> Trawl. Mm. Say that three times fast. Or they're supposed to be like the, the Egyptian the ones trawl, on, the, on the left. Trawl. I did it. Ooh. We can't have <laughs> a rockin' music festival without a rockin' venue. So travelers will be helping Dvorak spruce it up with his list of items. It's a piece of cake, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Totally, right? And bro. lastly, <laughs> we have the Meeting of Melodies. Can't have a party without adoring fans, so we gotta invite fellow music lovers to come jam with us. After listening to their tunes, we can restore the missing music notes. Oh, ah. so we'll be able to hear them sing. That is super exciting. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yes, that's the point. Music gets you pumped. And after we've rocked out to the pure spirit of music awesomeness in Inazuma over in Mondstadt, we'll be dancing to a tense and thrilling tune. <gasps> hold up, hold up. What do you mean by tense and thrilling? Does it mean anything? I don't know, I don't know I all say, too much about the music in the game. Wind Trace, though. Seekers and Strategy has finally arrived. What? Yes! At last. I love Wind Trace. And and yeah, it can get a little tense at times. <laughs> well, that I have the no clue new what this is. implies that the game has undergone some mechanics changes, yeah? Yeah, you're correct. That's very intuitive of you. Thank yeah, you. you'll be playing hide very and intuitive. seek as rebels and hunters, oh. just like before. But there are a few new ah, rules. I do know this. Yeah, when rebels are captured for the first time, they'll be exiled to the surveillance zone. That's for actually a short dope. Of time. Now, they oh, yeah. will be automatically freed after their time out, but also their. Wait, is this uh the same thing as prop hunt? I know hide and seek and prop hunt are the same thing, but is that like uh will that event be there too or something? Friends can try to help them escape the zone early, but if you get sent to jail twice, you're permanently deleted from the game. <gasps> That yes. Does sound tense and thrilling. <laughs> right? And that's yeah. Not I remember all. Prop Hunt. Oh, that was no. so funny. Each yeah. Six signaling devices. That was. Which will prevent that looks fun. Rebels from disguising or concealing themselves. The rebels' goal is to repair these devices while also avoiding capture. Once they repair Best four I ever devices, they win the match. Well, I'd be able to play oh, this regardless of my level. Together to repair these devices. I could see. And hunters will either. Me and Tusk. If you guys know Tusk on YouTube. Popping on here and doing some funny stuff. We need to prevent the rebels from repairing the signaling devices, or they can simply eliminate their opponents. Wow. If you team up with friends, then watching these games should be a blast. <laughs> ah, she gets yeah, it. Yeah, She gets friends. it. But the next part is even more thrilling. When rebels are fixing a signaling device, the device being repaired will enter the high-speed signaling state. What does it mean? It means it'll give off a light visible by every player in the area. In fact, 
The device will even be marked on the minimap. Oh, I see it. Ooh, okay. So that means that repairing the devices will expose your location. Is that like Dead by Daylight? Oh <laughs> it's these sort of unexpected risks be level 16. That can be the most nerve I can probably get there soon. Mm -hmm. This is going to be super I'm interesting to play. Yeah. yeah. Oh, absolutely. And in another event, travelers will receive a rather strange commission. Ooh. What do you mean, mm. rather strange? What I mean is, there's a chef who's famous for using unusual ingredients, and he wants to make friends with a pyro regisfine. Pyro regisfine? Oh yeah, and not just a pyro regisfine. He also wants to befriend a primo geovision and a jade plume terror shroom and the millennial pearl seahorse. Are these new words? Ah, uh, you guys heard me the first time. <laughs> I thought you would react this way. Anyway, a chef recently returned from a trip to Natlon, and he started getting some ideas. He thought he should toughen himself up by having his own companion. You know, just like how people from Natlon have sword. Ninja rank 60 awards that is fake. Makes sense. What does that mean? Kind of. Wait, did you say that he came back from Natlon? Listen, listen, Damon. If you want to oh, know the okay, details, okay. go check out the event <laughs> when the Virgin is I'm live, sorry. all right? But for now, it's time for me to introduce the, the gameplay. Game oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. All, right, okay, all right, you got it. <laughs> you got In it. In this challenge, you can adjust the difficulty and your negotiation strategies. Ah. If you've got the guts, then you can take on fearless difficulty. You can also talk to Ranjit to adjust the number of negotiation strategies. So if you reduce them, I remember people were saying that you will get free you five star characters, but it's fake. Test your Damn. Skills. Cool. Both active strategies and oh, this looks kind of fun. Strategies are 16 available. minutes of straight fighting this? At will. Holy However, cow. Your opponent's HP and level that's will actually kind of insane. depending on the number of strategies that Ooh, you've picked. Ooh, that's cool. So, yeah. So you've got to choose your favorite strategies to come out on top. Play to your strengths. Wow. Noted. And moving Play to your on, strengths. Travelers should be familiar with our next event, Vibro Crystal Applications. Ooh, it seems Not like the event involves connecting different vibrating crystals in order to generate different effects. Yeah, I'll I'm probably recognize so it once I see it. Intuitive you are. Oh they show gameplay. <laughs> that means that so is much incredible. <laughs> yeah, well, I meant it. Each round requires two teams. Before each battle, you can set up Vibro Crystal Harmonics plans for each of your teams. This will allow you to receive different combat buffs when you combine transmitter crystals and receiver crystals. Hmm. Basically, the transmitter crystal decides the trigger condition, while the receiver crystal determines the buff that your team gets as a result. By connecting them in different combinations, sure, you PB. can create varying harmonic effects. It's your custom buff plan. Wow. Spot on, Saramella Cruz. Thank you. And no lie to a new player, a this looks very confusing. For each time that you trigger a harmonic effect, you can get even more combat bonuses if you accumulate enough harmonic points. Each challenge will have different trial characters, so you can choose the harmonic buff that works best for your team setup. Nice. Be sure to maximize your points if you want to exchange them for rewards. Maximize. Nice. Also, the Genius Invocation TCG event Cards. The Forge Realms Temper will be returning Trading in version 4.6. Yeah. The Heat it should really just has a little bit of everything. An update, so don't miss out, duelists. <laughs> And there's going to be an overflowing mastery event, so you can more easily train up the characters who need the extra boosty boost. <laughs> Thank you so much, Max. You just did an amazing yes, job. That was impressive. Thank you, you Sarah. Mm -hmm. oh, and thanks, guys. since you introduced so many events in one go, I feel like you deserve a little break. Yeah, give my I, boy a little what? break. Oh. I yes, you agree. I was well, gonna say I, I agree. agree. So, I agree. agree. <laughs> so how about now? Let's check out the. The, the last, last redemption, redemption code. code. Let's go, redemption codes. <laughs> what do the redemption codes give? Did they say? Rewards. Oh yeah. Oh, they all give you a hundred. Oh, hey, fifty thousand coins. We're presenting some information about improvements for different in-game systems. Nice. Ooh, First ah. up, we have some updates for the Serena teapot, such as the quick obtain feature. Instead of having to navigate a bunch of menus, you can use this feature to put all missing furnishings into a queue, where you can use one click to purchase any missing. One hundred primo for every code, so I'll have three hundred more. Piece. Wow. Ooh, that's cool. That does actually um, sound that's very not a lot, though. So convenient. <laughs> How many so polls can you get with that? The avatar system will also be updated, so you'll be able to use more portraits of your familiar friends as your profile display. <laughs> oh, you get it. Oh, okay. That's fun. Oh, that mask is Hanachiru Sato, isn't it? Mm-hmm. 
Oh, and that's there's one aroma. pull. <laughs> and the thunder, Wait, is a hundred one pull or is three hundred one pull? Oh, and more. This is amazing. So <laughs> many more. I'm sure lots of travelers like them. Treasure compasses have also been updated. Its markers will be displayed on both the large map and the mini map. The compasses will also include information about different map layers. Sweet. Oh, way more yeah. intuitive. I'm not gonna lie. My Genshin Impact it's looks better than theirs. All the I don't even mean that disrespectfully. 160 progress. equals one pull. Yeah. So it's nearly two pulls. So close. Eradication. <laughs> now that we've gone over some updates to the game systems, it's time to talk about some Genshin Impact soundtrack news. <laughs> My favorite part of Genshin. <laughs> Is the soundtrack. Yeah, I love this. Right. I love music. Genshin Impact's third Fontaine OST, Cantus Eternus, will debut during version 4.6. This album features original music created by the Hoyo Mix team for the new cool. region of Fontaine and related content. Oh, yes. yes. Music is my favorite. So hyped. <laughs> oh, no, y'all. It looks like there's nothing left for us to present. Aww. I know. I know. So I think that means it's time for this special program to come to a close. <gasps> it's not so. Is, is there anything else that y'all would like to share with ooh, all the ooh, travelers who are watching? Yes. Uh, what? Uh, we need to have Vin answer uh, right now in this moment? Yes. Um, it's okay. You've got now. this. You've okay. Got this. Uh, okay. Okay. I'll make go. it easy and just um, well, uh, be very selfish and say that I'm just so incredibly excited for our Lakino. Aren't we all? Um, Aren't we all? Aren't we all? We did, we did we a lot of work Aren't with her. I think she's really cool, and I can't wait for everyone else to see how cool she is. Yay! She's so oh, cool. Totally. She's so freaking cool, and I love the whole quest and everything secret that I can't talk about right now. <laughs> but I am cool. also really excited for that and Linny's involvement in said thing. They're all excited. And They're all excited all for their own characters. Right now, guys. Makes sense. Yeah, it was Yay. so hard to talk about this without spoiling anything, but I'm so, so excited for you guys to experience this concert. It yeah. is it's so good, and all I can say is that I had more fun recording for this uh, part of, of Genshin Impact than I've had in a long time recording. So, oh um, my gosh, yeah, that's it amazing! <laughs> wow, it's kind of funny when you know this is scripted too. And I'm also really pumped for the Wind Trace Festival because I love it so much. <laughs> is she a part and of that? It sounds like there's a ton of awesome things coming in version 4.6. So I it hope is. everyone's it's excited. Like, yes, I am. This, look, yeah. this looks like one. One of the best updates well, I've okay. uh, I seen. I just have to say, this was so fun. Very cool. Being here with you today. I'm so glad I got to be here with <laughs> you guys. It was fun, such guys. a great time. <laughs> so thanks for being here. And I think that's all we've got for this program. So we will see you all in game. See you guys Bye. in the game. Bye. 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 Bye.